Matt3756. What's up, goobers? Welcome to Willet Claw, where I put items you normally wouldn't see inside of one of these arcade claw machines, and we see if we can win them. Disney was kind enough to sponsor and provide free products for this Willet Claw video, so we have Finding Dory themed toys here, guys, that we're going to try in the claw machine. Plus, after these, I'm going to take one of your guys' suggestions from a prior video and try that as well. So first, I'm just going to give a quick review on these items. I'm actually going to take them out of the box, because I think they'll be more interesting. Uh, to try in the claw machine out of the package. Uh, so we'll go one by one. I'm going to review them just real quick, show you exactly what they do, and then we'll see if we can win them in the claw machine. All right, guys, so the first thing we're going to try and claw is this voice changer. Uh, what you do is basically you just press this button here to record. That's button one that's on the front here. So, And then you press button two, which is this little whale on the back, and it like changes your voice into whale. So let's give it a test. You are a goober. It is mail time with Matthew. He reads mail that is from you. Now it's mail time with Matthew. This is when Matt reads his mail. It is mail time with Matthew. He reads mail that is from you. Now it's mail time. Okay, that was interesting. Let's see if we can win it in the claw machine. All right, guys, our first item up is the Finding Dory voice changer. This is pretty cool, actually. Um, for this, I'm, I don't know. I think it might. Is there's a little bit of weight to it, plus the plastic on the metal, as I always say, is really, really tricky. But I don't know. We'll see what we can do here. First try. We do ten plays per item on Willet Claw. Ooh, maybe if I get it. I think I was off to the left a little bit. I'm gonna go a little bit more to the right here. Try right there. Come on. Oh, oh, it wanted to get him, man. It like wanted to. I'm going to use angles here best I can. Hope you guys like the awesome new action cam that I've attached to the side of the claw up there. Oh, it gives an awesome angle view, I think. Try right through there. Plus, I mean, the shape isn't terrible. See it? Oh, wait, we have it! Could this have it? Voice changing Finding Dory! Yes! Oh man! It's gonna be a miracle if that ever works again. All right guys, so the Finding Dory voice changer, definitely clawed. All right guys, I filled up the coffee pot, which is actually gonna be our next part of our next item, but I wanna see if this thing swam and it's really cool. I wanna see what the cat thinks of this. What do you think, dude? Do you care at all? No? Okay, bored? All right, apparently the cat doesn't approve of it, but I do. Now, let's see if we can win it in the claw machine. All right, guys, next up are actually swimming Finding Dory fish. Plus, this has nine different sayings as well. This was, I was really impressed by this thing, actually. I'm really curious to try it in like a huge swimming pool. I don't know, this is gonna be tough. The problem with this uh, is not so much the weight, it's so much the shape. Uh, the, uh, the voice changer had that really, oh, might have to be laying flat for a better chance. The voice changer had that really, really nice uh, tail that curved, and that really helped to cradle it there. Uh, this is going to be interesting, though. Um, now that it's flatter, we might be able to get it. Let's see. Oh, that was good. Come on. Oh, my God. Look at this. Second try. Will we have it? Stay. Yes. Oh, my God. It broke into a million pieces. No, nah, it didn't. It's still intact. And uh, let's see if she still works. <laughs> You're dang right. These products not only are awesome, but they're durable as well. They will la they will uh, survive. Stop talking! All right, guys. So the actual swimming Finding Dory fish definitely clawed. And the last item we're going to try and claw is this Finding Dory coffee pot playset, guys. Uh, you place this little fish in, in the pot, fill it with water, and he swims around. So we're going to try that out right now. All right, now that we got our coffee pot full of water, let's see if Finding Dory swims, whoa. <laughs> oh look, it does, oh my god, that is so cool. Oh, it cycles through, I think, different ones. Wow, the, the uh, 
the fin goes and cycles through different modes. All right, guys, and last but not least, our Finding Dory coffee pot uh, fish that actually swims as well. Uh, this is gonna be interesting. Well, I'm gonna try to win the coffee pot with the fish in it. We'll see if we can keep the fish inside without it spilling out. I don't know. Oh, it's an awkward shape. Might have to grab it by the handle. This is gonna be interesting. I, we're two for two so far on our items, but I, I'm gonna have to say maybe no on this. I don't know, it might surprise. Maybe if we even hook one arm inside the, uh, inside the actual pot, like that, that might be our best shot at the pot. Oh no, didn't grab it. Try to go just dead center over it again. It looked like it wanted to pick it up, but it's real slippery. See, yeah, that's, that's the only bad thing. All right, guys, going again here. Just kind of just going to hope we get a maybe crazy lucky grab. Yeah, I don't think it's going to get it that way. Now we'll try again maybe for the handle this time. Go a little bit more for that. Let's see. Let's go forward just a little bit. Let's see. Handle. Come on, handle. Oh, we just keep tipping it over and standing it right back up again. Uh, I, I don't know. I think that this is going to be the... Let's try to go just for the handle without hooking it in the pot. Oh, I totally missed it. Yeah, I don't think that would get it either, though. And hand, oh, we got, oh, that was weird. All right, guys, three plays left here. I don't know, it's not looking too promising. This is a very awkward shape. You can never get it by the actual pot because it's just slide right off and the claw's too small, yeah. Um, the only possible way is by that handle. Fish might be adding some extra weight here, so that could be an issue as well. Try for the top again. Ah, oh, I keep sliding off, see? All right, guys, last play. I stood it back up again, just in the normal position and what we had it before. Let's just see if we can get lucky here. No. All right, guys, so the swimming finding dory inside the coffee pot did not claw. All right, guys, and last but not least, an item that one of you guys suggested. Uh, this person suggested a actual slam a winner extreme ball, which is an awesome idea. Uh, so let's see, 10 plays. If you're wondering how I got this ball, uh, an arcade was throwing it away because it was all, as you can see, it's chewed up on the one end, on the pink end, is all chewed up. And uh, when the ball is all chewed up, it doesn't work in the game properly, so they toss them, and I was, I was lucky enough to snag this which is awesome this is like a collector's oh it wanted to i don't know it's gonna be iffy so yeah this is kind of like a uh, collector's i i love that it's actually you could see the play from it too like it's awesome this is a total collector's item i don't know the problem with this really isn't the shape it's just the weight you know it's it, it, these are actually really really heavy uh maybe a little bit heavier than most of you guys think um so i don't know i'd say it's Man, it's almost a pound. This ball, at least a half a pound. Uh, now it's just not getting a good grip around it. All right, guys, I'm gonna try pink side down. Uh, the reason is because that side's more chewed up and that gives it a little, that gives the arms of the claw a little bit of a better grip. Uh, so let's see if that, well, we could do that. Um, and mate, oh, it's heavy, man. I'm gonna offshoot this to the right a little bit because my claw does go to the left when it has to go really far down. Ah, oh, dang it. All right, let's see, come on, we got five plays lit. Ooh, oh man, that, that was far around it too. All right guys, now I kind of just twisted it sideways to see if that helps. So we got the uh, half of the green and half of the pink laying down. So we'll see if that does anything. Offshoot it a little bit. I mean, it's like, that's a perfect dead center grab. Ah, oh, it's just slipping off. Let's see if this one does it here. Ooh. Oh! Man, it picked it up. It's just, I think it would get it if it just had a very secure grab. Because it definitely picked it up, but it's the weight, man. That actually really surprised me there, guys. I kind of twisted it back to how I had it before. Man, that was close. That, it's tough though, it, it really is tough, this item. Let's see, that's a dead center grab. Oh, now it didn't even pick it up that time. All right guys, this is our last play here. I don't know, it's not looking too promising for the slam ball, but uh, it's just like, if one of the arms would 
get underneath it far enough it would get it, but I don't know. Let's see if that does it there. Maybe. Ah, oh, nah, it just kept sliding right off, unfortunately. Thank you for the suggestion. Unfortunately, though, the slam a winner extreme ball did not claw. All right, guys, thanks for watching the special Will It Claw episode with our Finding Dory themed items here. Comment below, what items would you like me to try in a future Will It Claw? If I pick your item, I'll just feature your comment in a future Will It Claw video. And thanks for watching! Click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my future videos.